production of nano-sized gold. For this experiment, you need the gold chloride solution, the citrate solution, distilled water, a hot plate, a stirring device, a fireproof beaker, a heat thermometer, a laser pointer, and a pair of safety goggles. Measure out 28 milliliters of distilled water and add 0.5 milliliters or approximately 15 drops to the gold chloride solution. Now heat the fluid until it boils. If you shine light into the fluid with the laser pointer, the path of the light cannot be seen. A colloid is not yet present. When the fluid has been heated to 100 degrees centigrade, add 1.5 milliliters of citrate solution as quickly as possible while stirring vigorously. Turn the hot plate off, and after approximately five minutes, there should be a noticeable change in color to red or possibly even violet. Where does this color change come from? The citrate solution triggers a redox reaction, which reduces the gold chloride to nano-sized gold clusters. The citrate solution also causes these clusters to disperse in the water and to remain stable. It is now possible to verify the presence of gold clusters by using the Tyndall effect. As we already know, colloidal particles roughly correspond in size to the wavelength of light. This causes them to break up the light and bring about this extreme change in color. 